How's it going, everybody? Midnight Silver Run. Um, I thought we might uh, look at some 77 Philadelphia Minute Coins for some errors or varieties, but uh, upon further review, there's not really much uh, in 1977 to look for as in varieties and uh, errors. So what I'll do is, is I'll just I'll move this up a little bit and maybe we'll just get a kind of a overall look at a few coins from the roll because they actually look pretty nice. First one, one had some uh, nice little toning on it. I think this is the third one in. Nice clean looking coins so far. Struck pretty well. I guess maybe the 80 roll. I'll uh, do a little bit of a uh, do a little googling and see if there's anything to actually look for in that. I believe so, but you never know. Some nice looking coins for uh, sitting in a roll for 40 some years. And they are actually really nice and lustrous. It's, I've got the light on everything turned down that way. It's, otherwise it just whitewashes out. Nice looking coins. One will definitely uh, look pretty good in the album. See, struck pretty good. A few minor details right there. But all in all, not bad, a lot of bag marks. Really, the only thing I found for, uh, any kind of doubling is, is a, I guess I'll go in a little bit closer so I can specifically show you where I found and what I found. And it was only on, uh, was it Wexler's? And it's a DDR. It was pretty much some doubling right here in this area, this area, and the tip of the eye, like right there. It was very minor. I mean, you could see it, but it wasn't anything, uh, Nothing special. So we're not gonna we're not gonna waste a lot of time. <clears throat> I think these would more be for grade. You know, not I mean as in for sending in for grade, but if you're gonna look for a nice coin, this is probably probably the roll you're gonna want to look for in because it is a nicer looking roll. I'm seeing, uh, I'm assuming these are all probably, or most of them are going to be from the same die because I've been noticing right here on them that uh, a lot of the sevens have that same mark on it, which would lead me to believe it came from the die and not, uh, not a bag mark. Definitely be more than happy to put one of these nicer ones in my album though. I'm just gonna do a couple minute video. Here we just kinda look over a couple of these nicer coins. 
but uh, we're going to find in this roll, I believe. Probably got a better chance of finding, like, I don't know, die chip or die crack or something than we do uh, any uh, varieties of any sort. Let me check this U. Check for any die clashes. It's kind of zooming through them so we can look at a couple. Actually, a really nice looking roll though. I'm impressed. This roll again came from uh, Copper Coins. Sunday afternoon edition. This is the last one. This is about what we're gonna see through the whole roll. So, some nice looking coins. Nothing wrong with that. A good roll of 1977 to uh, have. All right. Well, I'll finish looking through these, and then I will pull. 88, 80, 1980 roll out, and then uh, maybe we'll take a gander at that one too. Alright guys, well as always, be safe and take care out there.